Hey guys, this is the Tarot Queen Jamila. I'm here to do a five card green moon money spread for the Pisces. So this is going to be a five card spread that's going to advise you on your financial situation for the last, last couple of weeks of April. So we're going to find out the Pisces current financial situation. Will money be coming into the clearance, into, not clearance, but <laughs> into, well, I guess, very soon money opportunities that you may want to consider more closely or what project will bring you more money and the outcome Okay, Pisces, so your very first card for the current energies is going to be the Seven of Pentacles. So the Seven is showing right now with your finances. Again, this is not going to resonate for everyone, but with your finances, Pisces, I'm showing um, that there's some sort of issue that's going on right now. Okay, and you're pretty much you know, working hard. This is kind of like a creative card. It's like you're not going to fail, but then again, you are going to have enough to feed yourself. So this answer, I would say that it means yes, as far as with the question that it answered. Oh, excuse me. The seven of coins means that the long period of hard work you're currently in will bring you much personal growth and achievement so right now you're working really hard and there's really not a clear answer as far as yes or no um, which is not a yes or no question so the next one is um, will money be coming into the clearance life very soon and you did get the lover's card so this is a major arcana um so I'd say this means yes, that money is going to come into your life very soon. Money opportunities that you may want to consider more closely. Well, this is definitely something you want to consider closely, Pisces, because this Nine of Swords, this um, fear, and this is kind of weird for Pisces to feel this way, but there's like this fear um, that's really holding you back. There's energies around you that are keeping you up at night. You know, I might be seeing some sort of sleep study that you might do. The Nine of Swords is really about, you know, fear that is not justified. Like, you're really afraid of nothing. But for some people, it literally is like a spirit or some kind of bad juju, you know, with that card. Card number four is... Um, who or what project will bring in more money. And so I'm seeing a woman with this Queen of Swords. She is not the type of person to be trifled with. She's really good with money. She's really smart. So I do see her as a literal person. It could be you. Okay, which is a very positive indicator. Okay, just make sure that you're not too, you know, controlling over the situation. Pisces. Make sure you let someone else have the input. Now for your final card, Pisces, I do see money. I, I do see worry. 
chaos within the, you know, this is about poverty. So, you know, again, this is not going to resonate for all of you. You know, but that, I do have to read the cards as far as what this sounds, you know, what it is. The five is not balanced. So that shows that there is going to be some sort of imbalance. But there is hope because as you can see, there's the church in the, in the back. So there's this uh, spiritual saving of yourself that you can do. And you can tell that they're watching, but who cares? You know, why is she so upset about someone watching her? Okay. Well, I got done with that quick. So, um, Pisces, I wish you got a better card as the final. This is actually what you're manifesting. Some of you Pisces are manifesting this, you know, the money problems, the poverty um, this is actually what you want. The final outcome is, is not just what's happening or what we can look forward to, but um, I just lost my train of thought. <laughs> but, you know, this is a really good card, you guys, and I am really tired, so I'm going to conclude this reading if you want a more personalized reading, Pisces, because it looks like some of you are going to need it. I'll probably be hearing from some of my Pisces. Um, definitely check out my website. I wish you um, money, happiness, abundance, and blessings. And thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.